Forward to Jacqueline Newsom. This is the new team. Joseph Shiner. Elijah Bitoff. David Kitter's been brought in and that's going to strengthen him. He's a 44-73 man. And John Antar. So, uh, what about the East German squad? Jens Karovitz on first. Frank Moller, Matthew Schersing and the great Thomas Schoenlieber. That's Peter Schwelm of West Germany. That's Rob Stowe of Australia. What a tough job they've got. They've come a million miles. But they've got Darren Clark on last leg. Peter Stubbs, Gary Minahan and Rob Stowe. And a good Jamaican squad too. Mark Senior, Devon Morris, Winthrop Graham and the great Burke Cameron. So... The stage is set. First three plus two from these two semi-finals. And the West German, not happy. It's the Yugoslav, in fact. Karolik in lane two. But the Italian squad, well, they'll be roared on all the way, but they do have a tough task here. The fourth round of this marvellous long jump with Emyan of the Soviet Union, silver medal position at the moment with 8 metres and 30. Trying to challenge Lewis, and that's another good jump from him. He's got a white flag too, but his own reaction there seems to tell you that Lewis will still be in first place. He isn't as fast as Lewis, but look at what he, how he makes up for it. The height he gets off the ball. His hips must be near 8 feet off the ground in mid-flight. 37 centimetres to find is a long, long way in a long jump. Lewis out there on 8.67, Emian on 8.30. And uh, pretty safe there, Stuart, I would have thought. Yes, indeed, but uh, remember, he is the European record holder. He has jumped 8 metres and 86 this season. And uh, I wonder whether... 8 metres and 53, well, that's perilously close to Lewis. He is gaining.